Well, Jessica, right now we know there is no power in the entire hospital right now. And you can see behind me here just the line of ambulances that have been brought here from all over the Commonwealth to help with evacuating patients because the hospital simply can't function without the regular power. And there is also no backup power here as well. We understand that patients have had to be carried down several flights of stairs because the elevators are out as well. This afternoon, a convoy of dozens of ambulances brought in to evacuate Brockton Hospital. The fire chief here says a fire started in the transformer room in the basement around 7 this morning, knocking out the power. The computer shut down and yeah. then, you know, the, generator back, um, the generators came back on and then the generators went out. Yeah, everything and went everything black. went pitch black. Those who work here say smoke and fumes started to fill the building. Plastic, burning, smoke, it's nasty. It took firefighters some time to try to put out the fire due to the risk of electrocution. Because of the way the power was coming into the building from the emergency generators as well, that had to be shut off as well so we could put the fire out. Since there was no power to the building, the chief gave the order to evacuate the nearly 200 sick and injured patients. We saw three babies. We just got discharged. As well as several people on gurneys, one after another getting taken out. Others walking on their own power. Doing okay? As good as I can, bitch. Right now, those patients are being brought to other area hospitals and care centers, while crews try to get the power restored and get things back to normal here. But luckily, no one was hurt. Everybody's alive, thank God. And back here live at Brockton Hospital, you can again see this is another wave of ambulances that were just brought in here to continue the evacuation of patients, which has been going on for several hours now. We can tell you that the uh, the mayor and, uh, excuse me, the governor, Governor Maury Healy, as well as Senator Ed Markey, have reached out uh, to the mayor here in Brockton to offer any sort of assistance. We also understand uh, that state police may be offering uh, a press conference a little bit later as well. This is an extremely unprecedented event for an entire hospital to be evacuated. We will, of course, stay on top of this for you throughout the afternoon. We're live in Brockton. I'm Peter Eliopoulos, WCVB News Center 5. Peter, thank you. We'll, of course, continue following that.